fit like a D. Danny Boy here. We're back with more Rise of Industry. Uh, upside Compton, a little town here that we've started supplying. And just a recap uh, for the first episode. Got a few industries up and running. We have water. Coming from the water siphon here. It's then going to this field which is creating vegetables. Now there are 15 stored water in here which is fine for the moment. There's a few water stored in here. 23. Okay, that's fine. Uh, this is bringing vegetables to our farmer's market where we currently have one stored and it's using two per week. We've also got two fish stored and it's using two per week. Now if we go to here, uh, we've got a few fish stored in there. I might actually try and transport that to somewhere else. Do I want to do that? No, not really. We will leave it as is for the moment. Now this gentleman, the AI, has set up a fish farm, fishing pier down here. And he's going to start exploiting some of them fish. But they're mine. They're mine, AI. Go away. <laughs> and the AI here has also invested in copper, uh, coal, and iron ore down here. They're supplying it to the wholesaler. I can't actually use any of that. They could actually be putting their wood to the hardware store, that's what we are currently doing. Uh, we're getting wood from our lumber mill down here. Our lumber yard is currently storing one. Our storage depot is currently carrying 40, so that's quite a lot. But if I need to do, I've got a plan, so if we push play. Uh, first things first, we've got 7 million left. Uh, net income is not too bad. Uh, total income is 43,000. So we're kind of just on the verge of making money and not making money. So we're kind of close though. But what I want to do now is go here. We're going to construct another truck depot. Now I have a plan. This is something I've been thinking about for a while. Can I get them there? Well, I most certainly can. Excellent. Now I don't want to use you yet. Bad maintenance. The state has neglected roadways. Damn you, state. Right. Go in, whoa, whoa, whoa. Go in here. Uh, we're going to build another farm. Now, this is using up some more money, but we should be good. Uh, I want it currently the same as this one. Uh, rotate the fields. We are going to have some more vegetable creation. Now, go away go away. Now the plan here, I'm going to stick my little roads in as well and make it look nice. There we go. Beautiful. Join up to there. Now you don't need to put these in, I just do it to make it look more aesthetically pleasing. Looks a bit more realistic with the roads around it. I can still get uh -oh, OCD. There we go. So that's our connected. Now get rid of this, get rid of the roads. Now I'm going to push pause and I do a little bit of micromanagement here. Right, this is currently bringing three water to there. This is currently stored up 16 water. That's fine. Now what we're going to do here is for a start, we're going to fire a road in. Now you need to be careful, you need to get rid of the bulldozer first. There we go, right, little road in there. I can still add two fields max. For, you get five fields max uh, once you unlock it in the tech tree. Now, this is now going to change its destination. It's now not going to go to the crop farm. Uh, it's going to go to this logistics truck depot three. This in here. This is going to clear out some of the stuff we've got stored. Let's get a pile up there. It now gives us five trucks that we can use from here. So, uh, choose destination one. We want raw resources and we want water, please. We'll get fire two trucks on that. And we are then going to go farms. I want two to go to here and I'm going to send three down to this. And uh, bring that down to two. Right, choose destination. Raw resources, choose destination, crop farm two. I then want three on there. These guys are then gonna destination. 
choose destination is going to be commercial and it's going to be the farmers market in Compton three trucks right that's fine right now push play now this has now got enough water stored it's got 15 two will be coming there and once it runs down we'll swap this about three water will be coming to here now as you can see this will start to get rid of some of the stuff that's stored so there it goes much quicker it's coming down these trucks are still coming in hopefully we'll be able to unlock our fifth sort of guys uh, gatherers let's take a look in here R&D points for this it's quite low at the moment uh, it's coming up though we're at a million and a half so farming is coming up as well we've now got two farms this will increase this a bit faster now industry is a real problem because I'm not creating anything I don't have an actual industrial building on the go now I would like to get a paper mill sort of figure out somewhere down here not too close to the city there are a few polluting industries around the area our fish <coughs> our fish is doing fine there's not really any more we can do with the fish it's going straight up to here five trucks taking it into the farmers market to stored we're hopefully going to be getting more vegetables soon there we are, fields, production, storage, none yet. I need to keep an eye on the storage on this, is now at 17, but two trucks will be bringing water in there. It should keep it afloat. Now, our costs are going to be more, because we've now got another farm. We've now got another truck depot as well. Now, let's see. You are storing a hell of a lot of wood. All five trucks are transporting. But they can't get there fast enough. Now, go to the recipe book. Uh, go to factories. The paper mill. Right. Cardboard. One water. Two wood. Well, we're using all the water for the moment, currently. Paper, two water, one wood. I'd like to use less water and more wood, so I'd probably go cardboard. Cartons. You need cardboard. So I would need two paper mills then. I would need one producing cardboard and one producing cartons. Okay. Uh, it's a few... It's a while I unlock anything else. What else can I create? Production. Hops. No. Wheat is locked. Right. I then need an orchard to create oranges and other things. Let's have a look in here. Orchard that grows fruit. Yes, I need this. So... We'll let the game run on, see how that goes. Now 160 can be stored here, so we're sort of good on wood for the moment. I'll stop these gatherers if it begins to become too much. Right, we're now getting more vegetables to here. Uh, vegetables stored is now two per week, but there's another truck coming in here. Our money is actually worse off but we did build another factory we're still marking a fair about 11,000 hopefully it'll come up now that we've got more stuff coming in uh, if I had faster roads that would even be even better I'd be able to get rid of some of this fish as well uh, there is no really anywhere else to put fish to I might just stop these soon and let this relax a bit I think you actually save money by shutting down some of the things but we'll fast forward through this year see if it would get to right we lost a fair bit there we lost 10,000 per month keep an eye on the storage here 16 water we've got three vegetables that's good storage here is six water and we'll have three more vegetables being created for that that's good if I had an abundance of water uh, that would be fine, but I don't, unfortunately. The storage here should have come down. Yes, it has. Now water is starting to be stored here. It is. Excellent. Right, once they build up a bit, I will get the paper mill up and running. I'm not going to build it yet because it will just sit and lose money while we're waiting. Right, net income for last month was 7,000. Excellent. 
So we'll let this run on. See how we're getting on. Storage, nine, good. Storage here. 15, 16, 17, that's good. So we are sort of keeping a float on there. With just the two trucks running, that's why I wanted to build up some stored water first. Now last month wasn't so good, we lost 9,976. So at this rate, we're going to run out of money pretty sharpish. Now the hardware store here does sometimes accept paper and cardboard. This one does not. So we need to sell it to state. Well, we're not just going to get that. You only get half the price if you sell things to state, which is near that great. Actually, I'm going to slow it down here. See if I can do a bit more micromanagement. Right, storage is 12 on crop farm 2 storage here is 17 so that's pretty much self-sufficient now that is good storage here is 13 that's good once they're kind of full then I'll branch out and start the paper mill and this will use up some of this logs uh, I'll have some going to the hardware store and probably just one going to the paper mill in fact, two, because I just want to use one water. So, this is where the micromanagement sort of comes into play. You need to sort of keep an eye on everything. Now, I could do other things, like go to another city. Like, for example, we have Wardo here. Uh, its region has wood, oil, blah, 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 blah. Now, hardware store does not accept wood. It does accept glass, dye, copper pipes, steel. We can't make any of that. So there's a gas pump right next to town here. I'm betting the people in town are loving that. Construction goods. This is a new shop that I've not seen before. Ooh, furniture base. Carpentry. Produce that. Oh man, I could actually build these. can I? No, because I unlocked the paper mill instead of the carpentry. Like an idiot. <laughs> right, go in here. Uh, go to this. Uh, here we'll have the carpentry. This just requires wood. Uh, you give it wood, it will produce basic tables and things out of wood. Uh, you can start adding fabrics and stuff to get different kinds of furniture but I could have actually made that alas I cannot so I need to get paper up and going and at least sell some of it to state now once these have filled up sufficiently storage 15 and uh, they are they carry 40 units so 40 units per slot tax break love it we do love a tax break, right, 15. Right, so let's speed it up again. We're probably going to run out of money. I dare say. But as I was saying, hold on. Who's just the slowest plate? Let's take a look at some other cities. So there's no really on a hanging world though that we can really do. Uh, Gra Cragby. Hello there, Cragby. Your hardware store except nothing that I can give you electrical wire no cotton if I had a plantation I could have given you cotton alas I don't and the wholesaler farmers market you don't accept fish or vegetables so there's no point building a farm here at the moment now if what I'm thinking about Dean is getting a permit for another city Possibly this. Small cities, yes. Wood, fish. This guy set up his little fishing area here. The fish are there. I could set one up there. Now, does your farmer's market accept fish? It does. Two per week and two are being stored. So that means this guy here is delivering his fish, not to the wholesaler, but to the farmer's market. Now, the store doesn't accept anything else 
but it does accept vegetables, so I could set up a farm here and start delivering vegetables to there. Now we've got an offshore oil gatherer. We've got some oil rigs here and they look pretty cool. Where's the helipad? Or are these the old school oil rigs where you need the... <laughs> do oil tankers leave here? I think they do. I think these are oil tankers under here. I'm intrigued. I want to see these. I'm assuming this area is here you can also collect sand from. Some hardware stores will accept sand. Auto save in progress. Thank you, auto save. You are the hero of my life. Right, now there's another oil field up there. Which seems a bit insane. Lumber mill right in town here. Sutton. Fish and wood. Excellent. And your hardware accepts. Nobody wants paper. Why does nobody want paper? <laughs> right. Fish and vegetables. But no one is utilizing the fish and vegetables. Where are the fish? There's a farmer's pier, a fisherman's pier here. Now, buddy, if you had stuck that there, you'd have been closer. Where are the fish, though? I don't see the fish. Okay, the fish are here. Why the hell did you build that there? What? <laughs> Your boats can't deliver to there, can they? No, that's insane. Okay, so the AI has got a mind of its own and builds stupid things in stupid places, apparently. <laughs> right, let's check the money situation. Now, nah, we're losing money terribly now. We're still at 6 million, so we can still afford to build a few things. Now, your hardware store accepted wood, didn't it? It did. Two wood. I would have to buy a permit, though, and permits are expensive. Expensive. The part and planning office. Compton is filling out nicely. Wordo. There should be one in the middle. Nope, there ain't. So Sutton, I'm thinking, is looking like our best bet. Because they're just supplying oil. And something is driving all the way down here to Wordo. That seems kind of dumb. But oh well, it is what it is. Now I could get fish going from there through that little gap into his nice shiny paved road and Sutton. Now fish would build up rapidly because the trucks have got a long way to go. I could then set up a water gatherer here, create a field there, create a lumber mill up here, deliver wood. Right, let's see how this is actually getting on before I go branching out into madness right there we go storage you still got 17 water you've now got four vegetables uh storage you've got 18 water with no vegetables the farmer's market here has now got 25 stored that's quite a lot now it will store 100 units so after a while, once that's full, we're going to start selling stuff to state. And we're going to lose a bit of money doing that, but right now it's all we've got. Right, storage. You're at 94. That is a lot. Hmm. Now I need, what I really need, is going to the tech tree. Ooh, I've got an R&D point in something. Oh, stop. Tech tree. Right, hold it. Hold hold the fork. Right, hello there, sir. Uh, right, I've got a tech point in what? Nothing? Nothing. I've got a tech point in logistics. Right, so who do I want? Who does this D? Hello? <laughs> Truck depot, 18 wheels, 2 plus trade truck capacity, interesting, I could maybe use that. And this is minus 25 trade dispatch costs. Now urban roads can build urban roads which makes, makes things go faster. Unlocks one dispatch slot for every building. 
Let's go with this. In fact, will I? Or will I take the minus 25% trade dispatch cost? Ooh. Right, I'll go with this thing for the moment. So unlock that. Excellent. Right, one R&D point used. Now, push play again. Uh, extra dispatch truck. Nope, it's not in there. Okay, is it in here? Destination? Four, yes. Right, let's send four of these out. Destination? Four. Right, so let's now get to send four vegetables out of here. I can then add destination four. Uh, I can't add to gone Hank. Five seems to be my max limit for that. I should have taken the extra dispatch slot for this, but it doesn't really matter. We're still working good with that. Right. You storage destination. Let's give you Let's keep it on one for the moment. I'll keep our dispatch cost low. It's only to go from there to there. This is what I was saying about the micromanagement. <laughs> right, we're getting a hell of a lot of uh, vegetables stored up here. If that gets to 50, I'll start selling it somewhere else. Now, keep an eye on the tech tree. Everything is good. Got six million left to play with. We'll leave that for the moment now. Oh, we've gone, we've gone awry. Almost got another R&D point here. Now sand, where can I build sand? Or water siphon, I'll give me two more. I'll go with this once I get it. Now farming should be coming up as well. Now that I've got two farms, it is. Logistics is coming up again, right. So our four trucks are heading from each farm, filling up the farmer's market. To mark a bit of quick easy cash, we'll send some to store. We're getting a tax break, nice heat wave, lots of summer days, water siphon production minus 50%. Oh goody. <laughs> now I'm not actually sure if there's a set limit in how much water is here, if you can actually drain it. I uh, hope no. But uh, we shall see. Is there anything being stored here? No, one seems to be fine. This one comes in, drops it over here. Excellent. Now, storage here. Right, we're doing good. Storage here, 15 water, 2 vegetables. Storage here, 23 water. Excellent. Right, now check the log situation because they were piling up quite rapidly. 110 units. Now logs were being sold to the hardware, to the wholesaler. But I'm going to go out and branch out here and we're going to build a paper mill. Now it's very expensive. Right. You can go there. Now I need to get water to this. So I'll maybe hold off on that for the moment. Push play. I'll wait till I've unlocked my R&D point. Oh, we've got an R&D point in gathering. Yes. Right now, unlocks the ability to place five harvesters for a water siphon. Well, that's good. We're going to do that, right? Uh, or do I want the sand? No. We'll go with this. Unlock, because I need to get my industry going. Right, push, pause. Now I need, in here, odd harvester. Uh, spin you around, please. It can't go in there. It can't go in there, so can it go there? I want one there. I want one there. Right, so now we've got five of these. Woof, here goes nothing. Right, build me a road, please, from there. Right, 
I then want which one I use has got the most storage 21 storage is 14 right now from here uh, destination one truck is going to be fine now I want to bring crop farm 2 down to 1 I want to choose a destination which I've not actually built yet I want a one of these please, a paper mill, paper mill is going to go to there, now trucks from here to the hardware store are going to be three for the moment and Choose destination, choose a raw material, logs, I want two trucks on here, choose a destination, factories, I want the paper mill in Compton, and then from here I want, uh, I'm going to make cardboard production, cardboard set, because that gives us two water and one log, no I want to use more logs, so Yes, set. Yes. So two logs. I want to use up some of my logs. There we go. That's going to store logs and then I need one water. So I'm actually going to set the destination for this. Uh, choose destination. I want state. I want the one state north. Five. Can I get five? Do I need five? Hold on. Oh, I've got five trucks come out of here. Trucks available. Zero. Okay. So you're selling stuff to State North. Two trucks are going uh, there. Two trucks are then going to go from here. Uh, you're going to pick up water. I then going to add one and two, and you're going to go to factories. You're going to go there. All right, push play. Let's see how we get on. This is probably going to cost us a fortune, and it's not going to work. We're minus six hundred forty-nine thousand in the hole for this month alone. <laughs> right, you got anything stored? You have two logs stored. You've now got four logs stored. This should start to come down. Right, once I've got this at max storage, which is 40, that'll be fine. I've now got my five harvesters working. Storage is at one. Yes, I'm going to need one truck for this now. That's perfect. One stored, one leaves. One of these will be going to the paper mill. Uh oh, go away, uh, go away, right. <laughs> Push play, right, let's see what we've got going on. Storage is at 11, it's still getting 2. Storage is at 15. This may even reduce the production of uh, vegetables going in. We've got 42 stored, which is fine. Fish, we need more fish. I don't think we can get more fish, I think this is almost at 83. Which is a hell of a lot. I want to see how my paper gets on though. Right, you've got 16 logs. There are trucks coming in with water. Hello, trucks with water. Right, there's the water. Right, the cardboard takes 15 days to make. That's okay, I'm fine. Fine with that. You just keep going, buddy. I wonder if things you make in here that are stored in here can be used. Ah, so it's good to store cardboard and you can switch it to cartons and it'll use the cardboard. It's there. Ta-da. There you go. Right. Okay, now we've got an industry though. So things should start to get 
better. Let's crank it up to two times speed. I've got one cardboard. One truck is heading out with cardboard to sell it to state. Excellent. Excellent. Now if I had a food factory I could send the fish there. Alas, I don't. <laughs> so fish is going to be piling up fairly soon. Storage, 89. We can go to 160, so that's fine. Once this is stored to 40, we'll then set these two trucks to go to the hardware store again, which is still getting plenty of logs. We're getting plenty of vegetables. Uh, if the fish could go faster, that would be amazing. Where's my fish? They've got the furthest to travel, unfortunately. So I need faster roads for this. Heat wave, water siphon, yes, production is down, I get it. I do understand. Right, storage is at 12, so that's coming down. But there's nothing going in there, excellent. Storage is this is at 13. If I can keep these above 10, I'll be happy. Storage is zero. Storage of water is here is four. Excellent. So we're doing well, kinda. We're losing a hell of a lot of money. We lost 2,000 last month. But things are working out well. Cardboard is going to be sold to state. We need more water coming in here. Now this could be easily fixed by just adding another water siphon. Add another water siphon in there. Putting some harvesters around there. But it's going to cost a lot of money. And I want to try and use one water siphon to try and fund as much businesses as possible. Storage is at 96. Uh, storage here is at 36. Right, so what I'm going to do is push pause. Right, these ones go into the paper mill. We're going to take them and add them back up there. And then we're going to push play again. That'll give this a chance to use some of the stored logs. We desperately need those faster roads. These trucks are going hell of a slow. See how fast they move in town? Yes, we need the new roads. Let's check the tech tree. Right, we're a fair bit off points in here. We've mastered all of this. The lowers the initial building cost, area of influence increase. Lowers the initial build cost, production speed of gather increased, increases storage capacity of gatherers, decreases gatherer upkeep. Okay, right, that's fine. Uh, let's go to farming. Almost got an R&D point in farming. If I could get a plantation, I need to find somewhere that accepts cotton. I need to unlock this to get that though, so... That's what we're going to do. Spend more, two more points. What have we got here? Unlocks wheat. I don't think I can sell wheat. Unlocks ability to place five fields for a crop farm. Do not really need that at the moment. Industry is starting to creep up, which is fine. If I could get the carpentry center set up, that would be nice. Logistics. I need this. This is what I need. This is what we're going for. We're almost there. So. That's pretty much going to be it for this episode though. There's some more water coming in here. We'll get some more cardboard. There we go. One water. Two logs, which we've got an abundance of. So that's actually working quite nicely. And I just need to keep an eye on the farms. Once I get better roads here, this will go much faster. Here are two water trucks, I believe, here. Oh, they're, they're up there. Right, I need to check storage here. Is it 6? That's bad. I need to check storage here. Is it 12? That's okay. So it might be a case of adding another water siphon. We'll see how it goes. Uh, we'll wait till the end of year 2 and see how we get on. We are losing a catastrophic amount of money. Last 30 days, we've lost 47,000. <laughs> Okay, that's going down to 29,000. That's pretty good. 
So we are actually making something. If I can reduce the cost of these trucks as well, that would be amazing. I think I want faster trucks for the moment. That would be nice as well. Check our tech tree. We've got a point. Ooh, we've got a point. The point is in. Yes, it's in here. No, it's not in here. It's in farming, isn't it? Yes, it is. Right. Can build plantations. Okay, go for it. Unlock the plantation. Right. Continue on. Here's us at the end of the year, though, so we're going to pause it there. Uh, play it normally. Hardware store. Accepts cotton. Ace. So that's another thing we can sell directly to this shop. I'm going to hate to build another water siphon, it would seem. Yes. I do think that would be the prudent course of action. So we'll get it done in the next episode though. But if you did actually watch this and you'd like to leave a like or comment, please feel free to do so. And if you'd like to see more if it's happening in the future, then uh, hit that subscribe button. But I've been Danny Boy, this has been Rise of Industry, and I will catch you later.